Well, right now we are less than two weeks away from the beginning of March, which means local grocery stores have less than two weeks to get rid of single use plastic bags. So how are the uh, smaller locally owned markets preparing for it? To your sides, Leanne Stuck will want to find out. The State Department of Environmental Conservation released their final regulations to implement the New York State plastic bag ban. After a 60 day public comment period, the state received more than 2,500 comments which were used to refine the ban to ensure a smooth transition come March 1st. Wegmans already got rid of theirs, and we know Tops is going to remove them on the 1st. But what about the smaller family-owned grocery stores here in Western New York? As of today, you won't be able to get a plastic bag at either Lexington co-op locations in Buffalo. A store manager from the market in the square in West Seneca tells me they're waiting until March 1st when the ban goes into effect. The same goes for Dash's Market, which has locations in Buffalo, Tonawanda, Williamsville and Clarence. The state DEC representatives say New Yorkers use an estimated 23 billion plastic bags every year for about 12 minutes and approximately 85% of them end up in landfills, waterways and streets. The DEC is currently distributing hundreds of thousands of reusable bags just like this one across the state with the help of various agencies. You can also buy a paper bag, but it's going to cost you five cents each with the money either going to local communities, the state or local food banks. So my advice, grab a couple of these for your next trip to the store. And before you go, make sure you head to our website WGRZ.com for more information about the plastic bag ban before it goes into effect in two weeks. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.